at 815 this morning. New this morning, Good Day Columbus is getting access to an area often deemed off limits to cameras. We're taking you inside an emergency room, but we are not focusing on the patients. Weekend GDC anchor Adam Slinger joins us now with the stories of people you might not even realize we're there, Adam. Good morning, guys. So you know that when you go to the ER, doctors and nurses, they're going to be there to take care of you, but there are other people there too. They're there to help you, and sometimes these strangers make a huge difference. When you need help, they're there, even if you don't remember it. I love coming here. That's the truth. Ron Bourne is a volunteer at Mount Carmel St. Anne's Hospital, just one of about 220. I really wanted to bring something that would make it a better day for the people I, I came across, you know? He spends his day in the emergency department often watches things most people would never want to witness. I'd never seen a bullet hole in a guy before. And he was sitting there in the chair with a bullet hole in him. Despite seeing patients at their worst, Ron comes in each week at his best, knowing he has a chance to make life a little better on the road to recovery. When they see a person like a volunteer that says, how you doing, you know, is it okay for you today? Uh, and you get all kinds of responses and you hope you're gonna be able to help them a little bit, you know, understand it's not as bad as it might seem to you. You know, you're gonna be okay. I think someone like Ron truly understands what it is to serve and understands the difference he can make here. Carrie Levicki oversees all the volunteers. She says Ron ends his days remembering the best part of the day. He's unique in the fact that he will come in at the end of every shift, always with a smile and always with a little snippet of his day where he feels like he truly made a difference in the emergency department for someone. And I love that about him. I mean, you are always smiling. Do you, do you get that sense too? No. no. My, you gotta talk to my wife. Known for his smile and his stories. I worked in technology. It was a neat job because I got to meet people. Thanks for letting me come in and help. Ron won't be upset if you don't remember him at all. They may forget your name, but they'll never forget your kindness. But odds are, he won't forget you. What's been the best part about the day so far? Today? Here, Many yeah. of you guys. And, and, and uh, maybe hopefully you understand that I'm just one volunteer. There's a whole bunch of volunteers. Even teenagers as young as 16 can volunteer with Mount Carmel. Pete and Karen, currently there are more than 800 people in their hospital system donating their time to take care of complete strangers.